I'm going to then mix the already made cookie dough in with these and then bake them into one giant Frankenstein cookie. I hate, ugh, I'm a texture, ugh, the egg. It won't come off. <laughs> Go wash your hands. <laughs> Guys, I'm so scared. All right, Frankenstein cookie pizza. Oh, hey, guess who I am today? I'm every birthday girl ever. What's that jiggling noise I keep hearing? Oh yeah, it's the birthday girl. Who's that super bright and shiny person over there? Oh yeah, the birthday girl. You know, the girls who have birthdays and wanna make a statement, letting everybody know that they're special today because today's their birthday. Pay attention to me. Acknowledge me in my birthday. I am special. Notice me. I'm that girl today, just like last year. And you know what that means? My birthday superpowers are back, which means that that I now have the power again to command all of you to like this video. Do it now, it's my birthday. It's my birthday wish to get likes on this video. You wouldn't wanna ruin my birthday wish on my birthday. I mean, to be fair, my birthday is July 7th, which is on a Tuesday, but I don't upload on Tuesdays. So that's why uh, this video is coming out two days before my birthday, but whatever, it's my birthday today. It's my birthday today in all ways. But more so my birthday's today. In addition to liking this video, make sure you leave a comment wishing me a happy birthday. Do it now, it's my birthday wish. I only get this once a year. Did you know that today is exactly three weeks since my birthday? This video comes out exactly around five weeks from my birthday. Today either is, was, or will be soon my birthday. This birthday meme on my channel will never end. I only get this once a year. Also subscribe if you're new to the channel and hit the notification bell. Do it now. It's, it's my birthday, birthday wish. You wouldn't want to ruin, ruin my, my birthday, birthday wish, wish on my birthday. You know what's really funny? Last year I wore this exact outfit on my birthday. So I am that girl that I'm making fun of. So if you missed my birthday video last year, for that I mixed every single cake flavor I could find into one cake to see what it would taste like. And it uh, wasn't good, but it also wasn't the worst. So this year I was like, well, I can't do cakes again. What other dessert is there? Cookies, which are actually more of my favorite dessert over cakes. I'm very excited for this video idea. All right, so let's go through all of the flavors and the mystery flavors I have not shown you yet. We have peanut butter, which I'm kind of worried is gonna take over the taste of everything. White chip macadamia nut, snickerdoodle, your class chocolate chip cookie, your classic sugar cookie, oatmeal cookie, which I'm really excited does not have raisins in it, and double chocolate chunk cookies. So I thought this was gonna be it. This was all I found at my store. But then I went to the refrigerated already made cookie dough area and I found these. Strawberry cheesecake cookies, Lucky Charm cookies. I wanna eat these so bad. And then we have Minion cookies, which you might say, Lauren, that's just sugar cookie dough, which we already have. However, you're wrong because I have had regular sugar cookies and I have had these types of image sugar cookies and they taste different to me. So I'm including both. So basically what's gonna happen is the same as last time. I'm not gonna use all of the powder. That would be way too much cookie dough. The cookie would not cook properly. It would be a disaster. I mean, this might be a disaster anyway, but whatever, it's my birthday, who cares? Like this video. Anyway, these are all dry mixes. I have to use egg and butter. Some of them called for vegetable oil, so we're just gonna do butter for all of them. They all have the same temperature, but different times, so gonna be a science experiment. But basically, however much is in one bag, I'm gonna divide among all of them so that I get little bits from each flavor until we reach the amount that's supposed to be in one bag, like I did with the cakes. And then once the actual cookie dough is created with these, I'm going to then mix the already made cookie dough in with these and then bake them into one giant Frankenstein cookie. And then probably put candles on it. <laughs> to blow out in front of just Bobby, cause this is a quarantine birthday. All right, let's do this. Okay. So basically each one we need about, oh, there's, it says tear here. Oh, that is peanut buttery. Okay. So it's about one third cup of each one that I have to do. All right, here we go, peanut butter. Oh yeah, chocolate chips, get in there. Here's chocolate chip. 
We have double chocolate chunk. This one does not have the easy tear. Oh wait, yes it does. <laughs> Never mind, it was lies. White chip macadamia nut. Don't you know it's my birthday? Thank you. There we go. Oh my God, the oatmeal. The oatmeal smells like love. It smells like a hug. Like if you ever want to picture what a hug would smell like, sniff some oatmeal. <laughs> Guys, I'm so lonely. <laughs> the only person I can give hugs to is Bobby. The last one smelt like what a hug would smell like. This one, ooh, it's really, really white. This one doesn't smell like anything. <laughs> this smells like emptiness. <laughs> oh my gosh, come on. This one smells like not good. <laughs> and here we go. Now there was no instructions on any of these. I've never made, if I'm gonna make cookies, I'm super lazy and I get the already made cookie dough so that I can also just eat it from the fridge, which I know you're not supposed to do, but whatever, it's my birthday. Oh my God, I left the butter out. Okay, so each of these needs a stick of butter that's at room temperature and I forgot it was in the freezer. So I put it outside in the sun a long time ago. Oh no, hold on. It was like you're melting onto the table. Uh, whoops, it's fine, it's fine. Oh God, oh no, oh it's melting. It said specifically not to use melted butter, but whatever. <laughs> this is Lauren's good enough cooking show. As long as it's good enough, then I'm happy. Yes, there was no directions. I assume I need to maybe mix it with my hands because it's a dough. Every time I walk around my kitchen, it just sounds like rain. And I keep looking out the window and I'm like, wait, no, it's me. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going in. <laughs> I don't know why it freaks me out to like, I hate, ugh, I'm a texture, ugh, the egg, ugh. I'm a texture person. Like I don't like certain foods that, oh God, cover it, cover it with the powder that have slimy like gelatin texture. I can't do it. Like jello, no, raw fish. No. Touching raw egg with my bare hands, no. <sighs> Welcome to Lauren's Good Enough Cooking Show. <laughs> I wonder if the butter being too melted is gonna be a problem. They kinda didn't rain. It's about to. Lauren can't remember where she puts ingredients for her stuff. Maybe there was bugs in it, who knows? Protein. So I just realized that some of the packages said to use water. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, so four of the seven say to use water. Uh, what do I do? <laughs> one tablespoon water. So maybe because it's half of them, I should maybe use half a tablespoon of water. I wonder if I can do it while my hands are like this. Uh -huh. I'm, oh, I'm gonna have to wipe this down. It's not in that drawer. Okay. I got half a tablespoon of water. I feel like it's gonna do nothing. Um, I'm a little scared. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, it's definitely dough consistency, so that's good, but it's definitely way stickier than I think it's supposed to be. This is why cookies are so much harder. They had, I think for the cake ones, I had one cake that needed a different ingredient, not four different ways to make cookies. I don't know what to do. Get off me. Bobby, 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 help me. I don't know if this is right. What? What, what do I do? What do you mean? It won't come off. Go wash your hands. <laughs> nice outfit. Thanks, it's my birthday. Oh yeah, <laughs> not yet. Could you not tell? Um, yeah. How's the uh, monstrosity? Horrible. <laughs> You're gonna taste test it when it's done. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so I'm clean now, but then I, I just realized I have to mix all these in. So I don't know why I clean my hands. I'm just gonna have to wing how many of these would equal like the same amount as those. Ooh, they're big. Oh, these are big ones. What? Look how cute. They're so colorful. It says right on the packaging, do not eat. It says, please do not eat, please. It's my birthday, I'm gonna do whatever I want. And because you put the please in there, it kind of feels like I have a choice. You're like, please don't do that. I'm gonna do it. All right, I guess one of each is fine. I mean, this is really just sugar cookie dough with marshmallow bits in it. By the way, don't worry, I won't be wasting all of these. I'm gonna be making them. 
I will be making them for some of my family that's gonna be stopping by for 4th of July. So don't worry. Whoa. These smell so much like strawberry. They're big. These are bigger. Why are they so big? Okay, and then minion sugar cookies. Oh my God. Okay, we're gonna have to use like two of these. Look how, oh my God. Look at it, it's so cute. All right, yeah, these are little. Yeah, I'd say about two equals one of them. All right, I, I need to. So good. I know, I know. I've been eating cookie dough for years, guys. All right, I'm still alive for my birthday. <laughs> I don't care if it's getting annoying. This is the one time a year I get to do it. This birthday meme on my channel will never end. Will never end. Will never end. Ah. Ooh. All right, it's not as bad as I thought. We'll deal with that after. Okay, so here's the baking sheet. I now have to mix all this with my hands, I guess, again. There it is. Gonna mix it all together. All I smell is peanut butter. It's gonna make me so sad if all I taste is peanut butter. Why? There's lots of colors going on though. There's the marshmallow bits, then there's chocolate chips, there's minion dye. Now we're gonna... Originally, I was like, maybe I should make a batch of cookies because that's how this is intended to be made. But because it's celebrating my birthday, I thought it'd be better to make it into one giant like cookie cake. Oh no, I'm so... I think I'm supposed to put it on parchment paper. What does it say? Oh no, it says on an ungreased baking sheet. I just greased it. Crap. Hold on. Also, I'm kind of worried this is gonna expand out of... All right, technical difficulties, I will be right back. All right, this may be the best or worst idea I've ever had. Hmm. <gasps> All right, worst idea. We got this. You know, for the first time ever, I was about to say to keep it on there because it's good enough, but no. I finally took another step forward in trying to make this as good as it can be. I mainly just don't want it to burn and I don't want it to overflow because it's gonna get bigger and it's already taking up like this whole thing. There's just random blue and yellow in the middle from the minions. It's like I melted minions into this, yes. By the way, I did like a tiny bit off, just to taste test it. I know you're not supposed to. I keep tasting coconut and peanut butter. Which cookie had coconut? Okay, it's been so sticky up till now, do not fall off. Here is our final product. I tried to make it as not thick as possible. I'm preheating the oven to 375 and then I'm gonna be putting it in. So the next shot is either gonna be me looking really excited or really sad. Let's see. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Guys, I'm so scared. Look how big it's getting. Oh, it's getting so big. It was a good call moving it to this thing that has a lip so it can't go over. Oh no. Please don't burn, please don't burn, please don't burn. Here is the final product. I took it out about three times and every time I did, the middle just jiggled. I was like, that's not good and put it back in. But the outside is definitely like hard and cooked. The inside might be a little, Little mushy, but I kind of like mushy cookies, so this is gonna work. Okay, I'm actually really hungry, so I don't even care what this tastes like. I'm excited for it. It doesn't look that bad. It definitely has a bunch of different colors. I definitely see the marshmallows in it. And this thing is so big, I'm gonna use a pizza cutter for it. Oh my God. It smells really good. These are probably way too big. Like this is like three cookies in one slice. Oh well. All right, I'm taking, this looks like a good one. Oh God, oh no. <gasps> okay, I did it. Ooh, it looks good. All right, here's the bottom, middle, top. I'm so proud of myself. I mean, I'm getting a little ahead of myself, ready? Frankenstein cookie pizza. Oh my God, it's so good. It's so good. Wow. I don't know what it tastes like. The peanut butter didn't take over, which I'm very excited for. I think if anything, I taste sugar cookie. Oh my God. This is, I just got a macadamia nut. It's like a surprise in every bite. I was gonna put these candles in it and light it for my birthday, 
but I don't want the wax coming down and ruining this cookie. That's how good it is. Hey, Bobby. Yeah. My cookie's done. Have you tried it? It's so good. Good? It's so good. I had a feeling it would be good. I thought everything would mix good. Are you being serious? Yeah, that's my piece. Take your own piece. Oh, you went for the big one. I like, I like the crisp. Yeah, it's good for any cookie lover. Oh my God. Ooh, I just got a chocolate chip. Mm. Happy birthday. I made my own birthday cookie cake. But seriously, like some people like, like softer cookies like me. Some people like crunchier cookies like Bobby. This has both of them. Cookie, big cookie. pizza. Big cookies away, yeah. Right? This is way better. This is even better than like making individual cookies. Cookie pie. I'm gonna have a stomach ache, but I don't even care. It's so worth it. Yeah, I would say it tastes like. Wait, what does it taste like? I can't pinpoint. I said sugar cookie, maybe. Yeah. Every now and then you get like a, a little bit of chocolate or mm. a macadamia nut. Or the marshmallow, mm -hmm. the colors of the marshmallows. Marshmallow, that's what it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's the Lucky Charms marshmallow. It's mostly just sugar cookie. Everything is sugary and cookie. Sugar cookie. Ooh, like that bite would taste of like a chocolate chip cookie. It's whatever you want it to taste like. You just think of it and it's in there, so you're right. This was probably the best thing you've ever made on camera. Yay! I could eat this whole thing. Look at that, look at that moistness. This is incredible. I need to figure out a way <sighs> to save this. <laughs> Hide it. Like make sure it doesn't go bad. Hide it. But yeah, I call it the garbage can cookie. No. Yeah, because it's a garbage can. You threw a bunch of stuff in it. I call it the America cookie. It's a melting pot, a mixing pot of all different people and cookies. Is that because it's almost 4th of July? <laughs> oh, actually, when this goes out, it's the day after 4th of July, so. Yay. Our country is definitely not doing bad right now. <laughs> All right, guys, well, I don't really need to ask you to do anything because I already asked you to do it in the beginning. If you haven't done it by now, though, like this video. I'm actually kind of offended if you didn't do it by now. It's my birthday. Like this video, leave a comment, subscribe. I wish I could send each of you a piece of this cookie, but I, I already have a stomach ache. Just buy what you did and mix it. I think I have a stomach ache already. It's a pretty simple recipe. I have a stomach ache. <laughs> and as always, I will see you guys soon. I'm gonna eat it. No!